Woo! All right, hey guys, welcome back, dude. Uh, Amnesia, the Dark Descent, right? Uh, this will be part two. Part two, guys, of Amnesia, the Dark Descent. So, uh, yeah. Let's continue. Rare books. Library. Rary? What the fuck? We're in the archives. I don't know if this was... I don't think we were supposed to go this way right now, but... I'm, I'm not sure. It's not... The game is not, like, holding your hands, I think, that much. I don't know. It told me to follow a trail, though. A liquid trail uh, earlier, but... Fuck off! Leeches. 16th of May, 1839. My diary. The unflinching African sun has continued Algeria? to our expedition, making it impossible to expedition. dig Expedition. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The yeah. professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No I'm leading them? The professor is keeping from me. The dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. I'm working for the museum in, in London, or am I right, or am I not right? My dumb ass, dude. Uh, right, fucking A, dude. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Right. I love the fucking... The style of the heart and the brain, like the, the art style or whatever. Crystal clear, yo. Uh, it's... Right, okay. Nothing else to see in here, I think. So... Oh, dude. We're... I didn't think, like... That we would have so many uh, posters on where to go, though. Have I been here? No, I have not been here. Wilhelm's contract. Is he gonna read or uh, am I going to read it? I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander. Baron of Brennenburg. That's the guy we we're after, I think. This contract will reign for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brandenburg, is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break this seal. Wilhelm, House of Ger Gerrick. Read by Ron, House of Strome. <laughs> okay. Did I fuck Did I fuck something up, dude? Uh No, that's 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 it. Right. Fuck yeah. Uh no mementos and no Yeah. The first part of my diary, I think. Right. I'm starting to feel a bit 
Crystal clear, yo. Crystal clear, okay. Mm. Hello. Did you guys, did you hear all that shit, dude? 17th of May, 1839. My hand <clears throat> trembles as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Mm. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. <coughs> okay. The crudely carved passage confused me. All right. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, mm -hmm. a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it. And as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. That's not good. I was trapped. No, that's not fucking good. So, one more thing about the Amnesia games. I'm gonna play all of them. I don't know how long it will take me. I'll probably play other games in between, but I will play them uh, in the order they came out, I think. Most likely. Uh, and then, I don't know, in between maybe the Penumbria games, I, I, I can't, the older games they made, right? The old ones, older ones. I think I got them all, I'm not... I think I do, I, I think I have them on Steam. Okay. So we should probably just find all these diaries before we go back down into that other place that I can't remember the fucking name of. I'm not quite sure if I want to go in here though, do I? There was something here, dude. Assholes. Fucking assholes. <laughs> my hair is standing on my arm. Not just one arm, both old tomes. Libri Veteras. Veteras. It's fucking bitch black, yo. I got a feeling that I'm m maybe wasting those. More oil, yo. Nice. Okay. I think that's a lot. Maybe it's it's worse if if we play uh, if we play it on hard. 
Which we might actually do one day because I'm dumb enough. Okay. Did we find actually did 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 we find anything in her? Except for the the this uh what what is called tinder boxes for fuck's sake. I know what that is. Tinder. Okay. Not 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 the fucking dating app. No, not the dating app. The 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 thing that you light and put in your uh, fucking stove. Locked. Why? Why is it locked? The door leading to the local history room is locked. Is there another entrance? Might be. I don't know. Probably over here somewhere. I don't know. Right? <coughs> These old fucking pictures, man. We're not gonna care about that. That's nothing I have to be afraid of. Nah. The fuck is this? Did uh, oh, we're not in a basement? Why is the rocks? Leeches, yo. Fuck em. Oil. Damn it. I don't get more than that! Assholes. I thought one would fill it up, yo. Like, totally full. Completely. What is this? A board? How's my brain doing? I got a little headache. Why are there bolts in this? Do I need to bolt up something? Nah, I don't... Huh? Floor plans. Okay, dude. Um... Uh. Thank you. It's so loud this game right now. Ooh. What is this though? Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wards. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us, especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Right. Right. East Wing and West Town Hall. Did I just get these maps? 
or I did not. So I have to go here if I want to check the fucking maps. Oh fuck me. Did you play Soma by the way? What a fucking great game. We're gonna play that one more time, at least one more time. It's been like four years, I think, since I played it. Right, okay. Why is that thing fucking fragile but not breakable by hand? But if we had something though. Something like this. Fuck me. Fuck yeah. Maps. Central Prussia. This is in Russia. Oh, you know. That area of the fucking world was 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 no way. Bright, <clears throat> bright light. What's happening? What's happening? Where am I going? Seventeenth May, eighteen thirty-nine. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. Yeah. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. So loud. So fucking loud. Oh, shit. Oh, just give me a second, my old heart, yo. Oh. Old man need to stretch. Ugh. All right. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless alien and impossible geometry. Alien memories of spark. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety and grasped Firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. A relic? How come this game is... The voice acting, dude, it's fucking great. I should do reviews. It's fucking great! Okay. Should I go down here? In here? I'm doing it though. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Activate. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, Dad. What was that? I heard. I heard something. Some sort of secret door mechanism in the local history room. We found all the diaries in the history room. Lock mechanism. Is this the history room?
It's her. How do we... How do we fucking open it, though? It's been dragged. It's been dragged across the floor before. Ow. I can't... I can't grab it, though. There has to be a... a, a um, has to be a switch. Is it a book? A fake book? This one stands out, right? more what the fuck that's more than one that's some timing mechanism thingy we gotta break this dude Oh no wait, my lantern dude. Local folklore. Allstadt and Brandenburg Castle, 1801. Uh, another region rich with lore is Allstadt. Deep within the East uh, Russian woods. For centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbors. neighbor, Castle Brandenburg. The quiet forest-clad mountains, dressed with scattered lakes, is a picturesque. Is as picturesque as can be. All by, the area is haunted by the dark. Ask any local, and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should uh, indulge themselves in such conversations, since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them have uh, their own twists on the tales, but there are some motifs that keep reappearing. So this is the next page, right? This... The Gatherers. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold dark woods and were forever damned to roam the grounds. The bodies wrought by the tainted souls have left them disfigured and empty of essence. Many have cited them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any beholder. They are called gatherers, as they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. Is it the prey, which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks, dragged behind them with which reveal their presence? What dark scheme do they follow? I wish it undone. That's a lot of shit here, dude. Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa, the well-known erudite, visited Alstadt at the start of the 16th century. He resided in, in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdom past. kingdom's past. During his stay, all the prominent members of society paid notice and he is mentioned in many records of the time. One day he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some ten years later. He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Ullstadt, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods? And uh, what happened to him? The immortal Baron? The Baron of Brandenburg lives a reclusive life with his family at his castle nearby Alstadt, and like most those of noble birth, rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals little before the castle was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander, a nobleman from the Rhinelands claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Is that how you say it? Prussian? State? 
Prussia, Alexander helped the region to flourish and remain popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage. Therefore, the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago, lived through the time of occupation and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle, along with the great leaders of this country. Yo, dude, okay. Got something to chew on there, I guess. Yeah. So back to it though. There's one. There's another fucking door. That's locked. So we got. Oh, there's one here too, dude. I'm using so much lamp oil right now. Are they color coded? Come on, fuck. Get up. Got it. Slight headache. Sorry. <laughs> As I said earlier, I don't. I have like a. Not very. Like, I bought a new mic, like a Red, a Rode. And it doesn't have like a, a, a physical mute button on it. And I haven't set up anything to quickly mute. Which is kind of stupid if I have to fart or sneeze or take a phone call or whatever. You know. Okay, let's see. Not that I have a fucking fart, though. Only girls fart. Okay, let's see. Um, a key. For the wine cell. For the wine cellar. A key for the wine cellar. So maybe that's where I wanted to go in the beginning, dude. And I didn't go down there for some fucking reason. A note regarding closing of the wine cellar. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with the absent minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brandenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave, or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can rot for all I fucking care. I put the fucking in there just for... Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would be a sense... It would in, in a sense solve both of my problems. Fuck man. Can I turn the volume even higher, dude? Uh, this this headset, it, it's it's actually a good headset. The mic was dog shit, total fucking dog shit. It's Ace or something, very big. <laughs> the clocks, but it's like I saw something about it. People complained about the volume on it. The name of the headset is Rog Theta, Asus Rog Theta Ultimate Seven Point One Gaming Headset. Uh, but I can't turn the volume up. Fuck. So, but it takes, it uses too much power or something, uh, so you need maybe, I should buy an amplifier for it or something. It doesn't get enough power on the PCC. Okay, so are we good to go down now or was there more? This, this fucking door though. What about this fucking door dude? Oh! Oh blind me. Oh, we're back out there, okay. So, have we been everywhere now? 
<laughs> I'm laughing. Why am I laughing? There's nothing fucking funny about this shit, dude. Yeah, 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 it's all good in the hood. All good in the hood. What, 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 what? This way, right? Entrance hall. Well, <clears throat> on that note, oh, the sand gave way to his tired body as he fell from the camel's back. He felt the wind gently sweep across his face and his dry crust lips. Yo! Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! What the fuck is this shit? What is this shit? How am I supposed to get past this shit? All is good. All is good. So I have to go down here then, I guess. But I knew- no. Ah, uh, what is this fucking shit, dude? I can't go in there. How the fuck do we get rid of this? What is it? Some meaty... I don't know what the fuck- it smells like shit, dude. Fuck you. Did that hurt us? All is still good, dude. What the fuck? Well, nevertheless, uh, we'll, we're, we're keeping it short. <clears throat> we went past 30 minutes later. <laughs> so, again, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you if you like this video. It means more than you will ever know. Uh, thank you and welcome if you subscribe. And have a great fucking day, night, or whatever it is for you, okay? Bye.